Hey guys, it's Dan Strong with Excel VBA is fun. Another quick tip for you. Whenever we use the Excel up, uh, whenever we use the uh, getting the last row, getting the next row, or even the last column, uh, typically, and we're joined today by my daughter Eliana, she's helping. She's helping daddy. So uh, basically what you do is you're essentially doing the same thing that Excel is doing when you uh, hit control up. So if I select here and I hit control up, I'm expecting it to land on cell A8. So control up. And that's what it does. It, it uses the end function to go to the end going upward. And likewise, if I click on K1 and I hit control left, I'm expecting it to go to the left all the way until it finds a non-adjacent cell, meaning one that is not, or a, a cell that's not empty basically. So it finds one that's not empty, so it's it's going to land on G1. Control left. That's that's going finding the end going to left, right? So uh, one thing that people have been uh, confused about. I'm going to zoom in here so we can see. Is instead of using instead of using XL up, they are using X1 up and so that's messing a lot of people up for example I'll give you a demonstration I'm gonna go ahead and um, run this user form in one of our basic series that does some sorting so if I want to sort by employee ID I'm gonna click sort and it says hey there's an error error 1004 uh, it's usually uh, it sounds like a VLOOKUP error but let's look um, click debug no, 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 it's not a VLOOKUP error. But it, there is, okay, so you remember when we just talked about using the dot end and we, we hit control up and it went upward? Well, right here we see that they're using X1 up and we need to use the letter L as in Microsoft Excel XL up. So I'm going to replace the 1 with the letter L and uh, it may make it more clear to use uh, capital letters, but they'll still shrink them automatically. So if I use XL up, there and then I put XL up instead of X1 up again that's not gonna bear an error so I'm gonna hit F8 and it's going to allow me to get the last row now without a hitch which is row 11 which is correct so and then it's gonna go through the motions of sorting so that's a huge you know you wouldn't think it's a big deal but with a lot of people they've been using X uh, X1 up and that's why it doesn't work when you try to get the last row. Use XL as in Larry up for the dot end. And again to left or to right or XL up. So that's XL to left. If you're going left, XL to right. That's T O R I G H T. And then XL up or XL down appropriately. And you'll get the last row or the next row or last column, etc very easily. This is going to, well, I'm, this one's already available for download in the basic series, but the gist of it is uh, what we just discussed. So thanks for watching and God bless guys.